cultural link that uh, Qatar is uh, offering now to Europe? Let me, let me tell you the following. I'm here for very important purpose. This purpose that I am the candidate of Qatar and the Arab world, the Arab culture, to be Director General of UNESCO. And to succeed in this kind of job, you have to have three things. The first thing, your experience. Let me tell you about my experience. I was ambassador for 21 years in the most important capitals in the world in Europe, in America, and in the Arab world. Besides that, I was ambassador in the United Nations, and I was also a representative when I was ambassador in Paris to the UNESCO. So I am one who could start the job from the day one. Second, I'm, I studied in different universities, in Cairo, in Beirut, in Paris, and in the United States. So this is multicultural uh, background. Third, Qatar, the most supportive country for the UNESCO. I think you followed what I've said, that Qatar is the only country that ha has a program that called Educate a Child, that and with the end of this year, educated 10 million child in the, in the most needed countries. Qatar is the only country, country who gave help for the heritage found with 10 million dollars. Qatar saved in the 80s uh, UNESCO when it was about to be bankrupt because of the departure of the United States with 20 million dollars in one day. So Qatar believes strongly in UNESCO, Qatar strongly believes be, 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 strongly in the, role, in the culture, in the education and science. One point that you would like to stress about your program I have, you know, all the objectives of the United Nations are very, very important. But two points are very, very important and urgent. The first po point, the heritage. The heritage now is one of the victims of the turmoil that we see in the United States, in the, in the Middle East. And we have to save this heritage. Not for the sake of the uh, Middle East, but for the sake of the humanity. This is the, this is the uh, heritage of the international community. And the second thing, UNESCO is facing a, a financial problem. And this is thing that I have to focus on. And my country is supporting me in this, in this domain. Besides, that I know that you, uh, if the people of the world knows rightly about the UNESCO and the objective of the UNESCO, they are going to help. I think our mistake is that we don't reach people, we don't reach the individuals, we don't reach the uh, big corporations, we, need, we don't need the charity people, otherwise they are ready to help. So this is another part of my program. So we need money in this period because the financial resources are less and less. Right, so that's, that's why I'm the one who could make this job.